This is by far going to be the biggest rival in the mobile gaming industry. PUBG Mobile and PUBG New State dropping today. So let's talk about it. What's going on guys, this is Riggs. Now, the number one, the, by far the number one most asked question, not only in the comment section of my recent videos, not only across you know all the social media platforms, of course those links are always down in the description, nice plugin, um, but specifically the live stream. So many people have been asking, Riggs, PUBG New State's about to drop, what do you think about it? Are you gonna play it? Your thoughts and feelings? That's what we're going to cover in this video. Um, you know, whether you're new to the channel, you know, whether you're an OG, you guys already know that on this channel, we keep it 100, no matter what. So we're gonna break everything down. I'm gonna tell you guys my thoughts on the game. And don't forget, for those of you guys that might not know this, again, for maybe some of you new guys that are rolling in, I was one of the first ones to actually play it. And no, this is not me bragging, these are just facts. Um, I was part of the first alpha, basically played the game nonstop for uh, for three days. It was like a Friday, Saturday, Sunday. So I know a lot about the game, and I covered a lot of the game. And I'm gonna give, again, I'm gonna give you guys my opinions on it, because I know a lot of you guys are in the app stores, you're downloading it, blah, 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 blah. Is competition is a good thing. And I think people often forget that because you have games like New State coming into the realm, because of things like Apex Legends and all the games, we don't have to list them all. There's a lot of games coming in, you know, coming into the arena. There, you know, there's a lot more to offer than just rules of survival and free fire. You know what I'm saying? So P PUBG has been at the top for so long. They weren't even the first ones to do this. Other battle royale games existed before you know uh, PUBG Mobile came onto the the mobile scene. But they have been literally alone at the top for how long now, fam? So a game like New State coming in is going to drive competition. You've already seen Tencent start to make changes within the game. Uh, as far as, I, I mean, offering free UC now, like literally free UC just for simply logging in. Um, the, look at look at the improvement they've done, and of course we already know. Again, we're talking about what no one else is talking about. It's what we do. Call me controversial, okay? Look at the difference of the seven-day login rewards since the inception of the game, right? So we're talking coupon scraps, basically junk. Look at what the rewards are now. On day seven, you get a permanent, a permanent. I think was it an Og skin? Um, plus you see, this is directly, this has a direct influence because, guaranteed, because of PUBG New State. So if you're a PUBG Mobile fan and you're sticking with PUBG Mobile, let me tell you, the game is going to be even better now. Why? Because Tencent has to be that much more on top of their game, no pun intended, because they know now, hey, there's another game people can go to. So we got to make sure that we are going to be offering the most dynamic gameplay. We're gonna be doing the biggest collabs. I mean, for example, look at Arcane, uh, you know, League of Legends, uh, and many, many more to come. Teaming up, you know, with Dr. Disrespect. This is, I guarantee you, this is just the tip of the iceberg as far as what's going to come with, uh, with PUBG Mobile. Um, and we've already seen all the past events, King Kong and all that. Vikindi's, guess what, Vikindi 2.0 is coming. I mean, they're gonna constantly be cranking out the content because Tencent is going to want to hang on to their player base. And not only hang on to the current player base, but bring old people back, right? What if people play New State and what if they don't like it? What if it's not as well optimized, like I was talking about in the beginning of the video? The bar has been set so high because of PUBG Mobile the expectations people are going to have when they play these other games are going to be so high and they're often, when you set up the bar too high, and this goes with anything in life, you set the bar too high, you end up, what ends up happening? You end up getting disappointed. And the, the, the biggest issue for New State, and not only just New State, but of any, any game stepping into uh, you know, this arena, right, the Battle Royale arena, the biggest problem is the first thing people are going, or the, the, the thing that people are naturally going to do 
they're going to have high expectations. And when your expectations are through the roof, and the reason why your expectations are so high is because of how incredible a game like PUBG Mobile is. And fam, trust me, these are facts, okay? It doesn't matter whether you're, whether the facts hurt your feelings or not. The facts are facts. Because the bar has been set so high by PUBG Mobile, naturally people's expectations, they're not gonna be low for New State. They're going to be high. And what's gonna happen is people are gonna download the game, they're going to play it, and it's not going to be, because it's a brand new game, and again, I almost feel bad for the up and coming games, because people are going to play them and their expectations are gonna be so high that they're not going to be met, and they're gonna have a bad taste in the mouth for that game, and what do they end up doing? They're gonna come back home to what? To PUBG Mobile. And the best way I can kinda of like, uh, compare it or you know to, to kind of like break it down is think of it like when you go on when you go on vacation right you go on vacation vacation is great you know you're traveling you're seeing something new all these new experiences these tastes the sounds all these things but what starts to happen when you're away from home for a while you start to get homesick right so and you come back home there's no place like home and that to me is what PUBG Mobile is okay 150 percent and you have to understand another thing you have to understand is i'm not i i never shy away from switching games when i started this channel i wasn't even playing battle royale i was playing clash of clans you know in some other games when i first 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 started the channel so i have no problem of switching games i didn't just switch game i completely switched genres so when i get tired of a game i stop playing it However, with PUBG Mobile, I have no desire or no wish to like play a, 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 especially another Battle Royale game when I already have PUBG Mobile. The biggest thing that they've done for me, as far as, you know, as in making a decision you know, of, of where I'm going, the number one thing that I have seen an improvement on is what they've been able to do as far as the cheating, the hacking, and how they've basically, I mean, it's not, again, nothing's fault, nothing's perfect. There's always room for improvement. But as a whole, I can pretty much say, and it's hard, you know, public opinion, it's very hard for everyone to agree on something, especially with how toxic the community can be at times. One thing that the majority of people will agree on is that hacking and cheating has been drastically reduced especially compared to what it to what it was you know so many seasons ago so that, that's one thing uh that is that is absolutely huge so and not to mention one thing i got to mention since we were already talking about hacking and it's probably like one of the biggest issues that people have with the game itself because everyone has fun playing battle reacts when it comes to hacking, crafting, I'm sorry, they're kind of struggling a little bit, if you haven't heard, with BGMI. Will that change in the future? Sure, I'm sure it will. Hacking just be bad in this game too. But Tencent has found a formula. They found whatever they're doing, they need to keep doing it because they've, they've, redu they've drastically reduced the number one thing that was making people leave the game, which uh, is cheating. BGMI with Craft and Ring the Show, it, it's kind of tough. It's a little tough over there. What I'm afraid of is that same thing is going to happen to New State. And I don't want to go through, I don't want to go through that again. You know what I mean? Um, so am I going to be playing PUBG Mobile still? The if you haven't figured it out by now yet, the answer is yes. Will things change in the future? It could, but as of right now, I'm playing PUBG Mobile. And if you're someone new, whether you're new to the channel, whether you're an OG that you'll see uploaded of my favorite game, and if you're still watching, more than likely your favorite game, which is PUBG Mobile, the OG. You know what I'm saying? So anyway, hopefully you guys enjoyed the breakdown, the analysis, uh, and again, something that not a lot of people are talking about. Call me Mr. Controversial if you want. Uh, but yeah, that's my thoughts and opinions. If you enjoyed it, whether you enjoyed it or not, do me a favor, drop a like on the video. Uh, of course, hashtag road to 100,000. I want to see you guys hit that subscribe button. But until the very next one, this has been Reeks from Reeks Game.